Hello, Kula here. Hope you guys are having a great day. It is Saturday morning and luckily it's a little bit overcast so this lighting hopefully won't get too weird in this video although I can kind of see you can see I have the lamps here and then the windows here. I have a lot of videos to make for you guys. I got a lot of really neat stuff this week that I'm really excited to show you so I'm gonna just get started right away. I'm gonna start with something kind of new. Uh, I got the August 2014 Glamour Doll Eyes uh, of the Month. Really excited to get this. This is not an exclusive subscription, but there's very few people allowed to have it at one time because uh, Glamour Doll Eyes is an independent company. Um, they're like an eyeshadow beauty company. Um, they come out with these of the month every month. It's a special color, I believe, that's only available in the of the month collections. And I just was really excited about it. I saw a couple of videos about these on YouTube. Um, I've always really wanted to try it. It's a little different than other subscriptions. Um, you're only allowed to sign up one day in a month. You can sign up for an email that lets you know when that is. And then um, you can select one month, two months, three months. There's also six month and one year subscriptions, but because we're getting near the end of the year, they, those weren't available. So I got a three month subscription. Um, it ended up being about $7, including shipping a month. So really, really pumped about this. Just super excited. This is also an extras month, which means we get more additional things besides just the eyeshadow. So in every bag, she includes uh, some of her business cards here. And I believe this is the, well, just the look, I guess. So that's really cool. Um, there is a business card for Sedona Lace because they're like best friends. And then in this month, we also got an eyeshadow from Darling Girl. So they included this uh, business card here. And then there's a code on the back. And then for this month, uh, it is the eyeshadow is called Cement Heart. And this kind of talks about it here. And then this talks about the extras as well. Um, in this bag, we also got a Hydra Glaze, which is a lip product, and then a blush sample. That's really exciting. Uh, so every month, she also includes some candy. This month, we all got, from what I've seen, uh, three of these Sour Punch straws. I love these. I just, I love candy. I love getting candy. Candy is always exciting. So I'll start with the of the month eyeshadow. So this is Cement Heart, as you can see. And then it's cool because she labels on here, um, what they're safe for, whether or not they're vegan, which is good to know. So let me get my little info card. So it says it's a dark gray base with a green and purple light sheen and multicolored sparkle. And it is safe for eyes, lips, face, and nails. And like I said, it's not vegan. So this is the color here. I think it's absolutely stunning. You can kind of see it on the lid here. One thing I'm not really used to is using these kind of uh, not pressed eyeshadows. So this is going to definitely take some getting used to for me, but there's just so much sparkle in this. And this is over like on prime skin. I think you can use these wet as well and that would increase the color pigmentation, but just that is a gorgeous color. So really pumped. Like I said, I'm really excited about getting the subscription. I'm so glad I was able to get the three month subscription. Um, I'll continue on with the Glamour Doll Eyes products and then I'll do the uh, Darling Girl, I think it's what it's called. Darling Girl, I'll do that one last. This is the blush sample. This is actually more of a highlighter. Uh, you could have gotten this in Miss Monroe, which is what I got, or Hollywood Affair. And Miss Monroe is a soft, creamy peach with a red and pink shift. Uh, it is vegan and it is approved for eyes, lips, face, and nails. So this is it here, Miss Monroe. And this one has a sifter on it. You can order these with or without sifters. I think I actually prefer them without sifters. I think they're just easier to get out of the package and use. This one is really, really close to my skin tone, so it's kind of hard to see it. And it's kind of hard for me to get a swatch with this sifter, but that's kind of what the color is. Like I said, it's more of a highlight than a blush, but it is super pretty. It has a really gorgeous, like, iridescence to it, like a really fine kind of shimmer. You can see it kind of there next to Cement Heart. Super gorgeous. And then the other sample is the Hydra Glaze, and it is in the color Homicide, I believe, and I believe everyone got the same color. Uh, Hydra glazes are made by our sponsorship manager, Piper. Each glaze is made by hand and with extra special care. Piper puts, all, puts her all into this product and when applied, a little goes a long way. And Homicide is a matte true red gloss with a buttercream scent and it is not vegan. A lot of red things aren't vegan. Um, the way they get some red pigments is actually crushed up beetles. 
so good to know. I'm not really like weirded out by that stuff. I mean, everything we eat and do is plant and animal based and it's kind of all the great circle of life. So not that weird to me. This one's gonna be kind of hard to show you guys just cause it's it kind of in a messy container, but that's it there. It kind of looks like blood, which is awesome. So I'm gonna take a little bit of, ooh, a lot of this does go a long way. It's very like a jelly texture. So that's it there. And then we'll put it on the back of my hand. That's really pretty. So that'll be a really nice like red layering glaze. And it does smell like buttercream, which is an excellent scent. I love things with like vanilla buttercream scents. I really don't like lip products with mint scents. Um, I just don't like mint, unless it's gum. For some reason I love mint gum, but I can't deal with like mint scented lip products. Those, I don't like them very much. So just do a little bit of cleaning up here. And then finally we'll get to the Darling Girl Shadow. So this is Teal Me Lies. So I'll get this out here. Let's see. And this is not lip approved. And I think they describe it on here. Teal Me Lies, medium teal with blue iridescence and a light sprinkling of lavender sparkles. All right, and this is safe for eyes, face, and nails. And that's it there. That's just a really pretty teal color. I love these kind of blue eyeshadows. I'm not quite daring enough yet to wear them full force, but that's just a little dip in there. That's so pretty. And this is just a very sheer wash of this color. I can kind of see it mix up here with my cleaning, when I cleaned off the swatch of the lip product. You can see how it kind of would look wet, so it intensifies the color, but it's just a really pretty, soft, like, not quite duochrome, but there's definitely, like, a blue-purple shift to it, and that is just absolutely gorgeous. And that is my Glamour Doll Eyes of the month for August 2014. I'm just super pumped to get this subscription. I'm so happy. I have a three-month. I really wish I had a chance to get, like, a one-year, because I totally would have. Like, I think this is a really cool subscription. I love that it's, like, an independent eyeshadow company. They actually have a lot of really cool colors on their website, and I kind of have been considering purchasing from them. Um, I just haven't, you know, pulled the trigger yet, and like I said, I'm still not confident with using not pressed powders, so I think I'm going to give these a try, see how they work for me, see if I can kind of, you know, get over the learning curve, and then maybe I will place my very first Glamour Doll Eyes order. Very excited. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and then you have a great rest of your day, and thank you so much for watching.